Welcome to our how-to video on loading data. So you've installed SurvivalWare and you're ready to get started crunching numbers and viewing trends. Go ahead and open up SurvivalWare and click on the load data icon from the home screen. You'll notice three empty input lines. One for your balance sheet data, one for profit and loss data, and one for your roadmap which you prepare in SurvivalWare by clicking on the Roadmap icon and taking line items from your data to line items in SurvivalWare. For your balance sheet and profit and loss, you'll need to go into your accounting software and export both as a .csv file. I'll show you how to do this in QuickBooks since it's most common, and how-to videos on exporting from other accounting software will be hosted on our website as soon as they become available. So for now, in QuickBooks, go to Reports, and down to Company and Financial, and then Profit and Loss Standard. We'll want to change the dates to include as many months as we'd like to view. This Fortnox model for SurvivalWare holds up to five years of data. Now, change the column setting to month, and that's important. Now we click on export and save it as a comma separated values file, or CSV. I'll call mine test pl 2007 and save it. Now, for my balance sheet, I go back to reports, company, and financial and then down to Balance Sheet Standard. In the window that pops up, I'll need to click Modify Report so that I can change the column setting. I once again adjust the dates to include as much data as I'd like to view. And then change the display column setting to month. And now I can go to the Export button once again, export as a CSV file. I'll call this one test-bs-2007 and click save. Back to the load data module in SurvivalWare, I can browse from my balance sheet, having made note of where I saved it. And then do the same for the profit and loss sheet. Roadmap, what I would normally do is click on the Roadmap icon and drag line items from my data to line items in SurvivalWare. However, that's a process that necessitates its own how-to video. So for now, I have a sample.srm file already made and I can simply browse for that. Then click on Import Data and no errors detected. That's a good thing. Now I can go to my data viewer and see the income statement and balance sheet that I just imported. As well, I have cash flow variables, days of working capital, valuation, and the all important import checks. The import check takes totals from your general ledger and compares them to totals that SurvivalWare calculates. If the difference between the two is zero, then your rows have been mapped correctly. Otherwise, you need to find the discrepancy and remap the errant line. Luckily, we did ours correctly, so now we can view trends and, of course, use the comparinator and printout reports. Thanks for watching.